suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water. If you wanna know what a bivalve is about, they suck the water in, then they spit the water out. Tissues need oxygen, gotta get their fill. Gas exchange occurs, water flows over the gills. Suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water. This flow of water lets them filter feed, bringing in microbes and algae that they need. Swept towards the mouth of that, you can be sure. That's what all the silly are for. Suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water. Spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water. Water used up and needs to be replaced, as it leaves also removing any waste. Gametes exhale and siphon can get rid of ya. Same thing for tiny offspring called Wilkidia. Suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water. Bivalves have other tissues as well. A heart pumps blood, a mantle makes the shell. Adductor muscles keep the shell shut. And for burrowing a muscular foot, suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water. Sometimes my valves need a little luck, always being hunted by muskrats and ducks. Can you imagine just how it feels? Always being hunted by otters and eels. Suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit out the water, suck in the water, spit.